What's going on, YouTube? Today we are back with Idol Huntress, and I kept my word. Um, I did not use my 10 recruits that I earned. Now I have 22, so we're gonna get right into that shortly. I'm hoping I get Robin Hood. Um, anytime I gain these uh, 3,000 gems that I need right here. Someday, please, please. Anyway, so yeah, so if you're playing this game, make sure to click on your gems and to get the daily, the weekly, and the monthly free gem. And if you stream, do not click the bot the uh um tab below this. We're gonna skip that tab. Do not do not click that one on stream or or on recording um so yeah let's let's go and get these pulls uh i only have one how am i supposed to get this when you you can barely add people in this it doesn't make sense anyway let's go to normal um see if we get anything new Uma Kotaro, a gambler, giving up herself. Well, that can be interpreted, you know? Who is this? Romulus, a kind-hearted knight dedicated for justice. Listen, I already have a defense waifu. But there's room for another. A lahire, glamorous drunkard. Oh, cool... Uh, <clears throat> bear, cool, cool bear. I love to drink bear from time to time. Anyone new? Anyone new? Please. Okay, no one new. <laughs> That's okay. Oh, I forgot to do this next time. We'll do it next time. Um, so there's a wish list. To unlock, try normal recruit 100 times. So I wonder if you can get to uh, of your choice or if it's a gamble between the two you put right there. I want to try this so bad. Oh my goodness. So, so bad. Anyway, so we got our girls here. Let's level them up, right? So we're going to go here to their equipment. And we're gonna give them the best gear that they could possibly have. We're gonna click on the arrow and just cycle through, see if uh, we we need to equip any stuff onto them. And we do not. So, uh, so she is really good. She's a defense unit. Um, she's a SSR, so she has like all the abilities, I believe really really strong and you can see over here her uh, stuff unlocks at like certain levels like the next thing we're gonna unlock is i guess that this is when she reached three stars next thing we're gonna unlock is the level two for the shield um applies a shield equal to 200 percent so yeah that's uh 200 percent of attack and then there, there are like different uh, things you can do. Um, this unlocks when she reaches three stars. You can also click right here. And you get a little bit about her, her height, her blood type. And if you care about any of that stuff. She's 20. She's 20, YouTube. She's, she's 20. A a according to that piece of text so yeah you can also see you can also hear the voice so yeah that's cool that's cool and there's like a bunch of different bunch of different stuff there and some letters i haven't unlocked any of that uh this thing 
Oh, uh, if you hold and move your finger or your mouse, they follow um, wherever you're uh, pointing. And this is Bond. Alright, I'm not gonna... I will not read that, but... Uh... So yeah, let's unlock her next skill. Just need one more up. Ooh. How do I get this? How do I? I need some more of those. Um, yep. So until I get those, I am not unlocking Jack. Dang it. All right. Time to go and grind, right? Let me look at this quest. Some stuff to unlock. Ooh. Uh, any, any more? I don't know what this play together thing is. Quest time, two hours. Um. I don't know who's who. Okay, well, I can see the rarities, therefore, Shield Girl and DPS. Conditions not met. Only one. Hmm. In that case, I'll just let... Wait. Super rare. Oh, oh I see. Hmm. So it can be one of the two in that case. We can choose her since she's on our team. Conditions not met. Perhaps another person like her. Okay, they're doing stuff. Um. All right. Now I want to go down to shrine. See what that's all about. We got Power of Faith, Bond, Temple. Temple being the next unlock. Let's go to Painting Scroll. There's a painting we can click on. Let's unlock. That isn't my real name, but one of my benefactors gave it to me. It's very important. So, I'm not, oh, okay, effective to all huntresses, cool, so by doing that, there's a beautiful wife archetype, perhaps if we have all of them, uh, or maybe I have to recruit them, and then I'll get the bonus. Hmm. Alright. So I did level up a bit. I added an additional friend. There goes my internet. They're both online. They're grinding. See if I can add another person. No, I cannot. Alright, let's... Can we go on, ad on adventures? Yes, we can. Wow, this is a first. I had no idea I unlocked that. Let's go to Tower Challenge. Queen's Tower. Um, Okay, your, your typical tower thingy. Let's challenge. Let's click on that. It's going to be a walk in the park. The usual. We're too strong for these level sixes. Let's go to the next stage. So yeah, like I said, it's your basic idol game. Um, if you're familiar with idols, you already know the gist of how it goes. There's usually a bunch of time wasters. Um, certain idol games will allow you to like just send them off on like these tower runs and uh, then you can go and do something else while they're in a tower run. Which is a nice uh, feature, but I guess because it like locks you to actually being there, I kind of like it because you have to 
be occupied with one thing. You can't just spam a whole bunch of stuff and have it all done at once. You know, you gotta pay a little bit of attention to the progression of your units. So yeah, here's some tower gameplay. And the game definitely isn't a walk in the park, it's... Higher the level you face, the... The harder it is to truly beat them. Usually, uh... You know, regardless of levels to an extent, in these mobile games, you're always, like, powering through the mobs and stuff like that, but... Um... Unless you're, like, leveling up your units and giving them nice equipment and leveling up their skills and stuff like that, uh... It'll, it'll, it'll be hard if you don't, you know, stay on top of things. I'm loving that shield, just for two turns, very useful. And although we don't have like a healer, uh, I do believe we do get a little bit of heals, nothing too strong. But yeah, power runs is just another way to get a bunch of resources and test your units. Which I find, it's like a nice barometer to just see where you stand, you know. The higher up in the tower you are, the stronger you are and the more good about yourself you feel. Oh, and we also gain those uh, little orange crystals that we needed to level up uh, these super, super rares. So I could, I could choose to upgrade her. You know, let me do that until I hit a roadblock, perhaps. Or, or uh, until it becomes extremely expensive. Yeah, let's level her up. She's my main attacker. So we have to treat her well. Also becoming a little bit expensive. Let's so give some love to her because she's also another attacker. She's actually, I think she does some AoE. AoE abilities. My internet is like, you're going too fast. Um, do I wanna... Do I wanna spend stuff on her? Hold on. Uh... See if I have another unit. Water. Water. Hmm. Romulus. Oh, but she's defensive. Yeah, but hey, if you're... You can also see comments. Why is her in-game model look different than her art? Another illegally large uh, bazooka. But yeah, if you're into the water affinity or just into this character, you know, it's, it's different from the earth affinity. I love this one so far. It's my favorite. Um... Yeah. I guess... Let's just level up her. Wait, is she Earth? I might need to branch out. Oh, well, let's give her her next ability. And... Make sure they're all at least... 21 of level. Alright. Here we go. I am broke. I have nothing. Go to challenge. I think I lost to this comp previously when I fought them. But it should be a piece of cake now. You should give them the beat down that I was hoping to give them earlier. Luckily, I didn't record that, right? 
Like, when I tell you we lost, we lost. Look at that, look at, look at, mm, that defense, that impenetrable, divine holy shield. They, they can't break through it. It's too much for them. It's, it's, it's too, the, the power levels are just too high. Nice little celebration. This is the next stage. So yeah, further in the stages we go, the more of the game features we unlock. So this is something, this is the, the most important progression right here. Also, I, I've, I've said this before, but I, I love the loading screen. Um, it would be it would be nice if like we could view those uh, screens whenever we wanted, or like if we could uh, have them on like a certain amount of rotation. But anyway, uh, like that one right there with that sea monster is really dope. Okay, let me go to quest. Get all of this. We need as much diamonds as we can get. 1,000 more? Say no more. Say no more. Let's go on an adventure. Um, so we can move this. Maybe more things open up the higher we progress there's an arena there's a super arena if arena wasn't enough you know there's an even arena that's more of an arena than the arena you got this uh maelstrom whirlpool all right let's go to tower Challenge, see if, uh, wonder if it would, uh, let's see what this says. After clearing the current floor, you'll obtain generous clearance. Yep. All right, let's do that. Let's, let's do a bit more of this. I would love for my first lineup, basically the lineup I'm using right now to just be one that could handle you know, all of the affinities, or a majority of the affinities, without having to swap. Because when you have to swap units in a game, it, you know, it becomes a little bit much. Unless it's like PvP, but then uh, even for like PvP, I don't want to know what my opponent has. You know, I just want to know their power level and that's it, right? Because if I can know what units they're using, then it's kind of, kind of, it's it's very cheesy because then I could just play around that, and I I, I don't value uh, knowing my opponent beforehand, you know, unless I've fought them before and whatnot. Then I can like have an an expectation of their play styles and stuff like that. Yeah, we got yet to try out. We got yet to try out PvP. I just want to do one more, one more. Just get get a little bit uh, more resources. See if we can level anyone up. Let me know in the comments if you're uh, enjoying the video. Don't forget to give it a like, and don't forget to subscribe if you want more, or if you want to see. Well, you know, not if you want more, because you know I'm always gonna upload you know don't don't feel you need to do anything for me to upload i'm always gonna upload um but you know uh let me know if you're playing the game or if you're not playing the game and stuff like that um let's get out of there get out of there out of that am i the only one that saw that black screen must be my internet uh, go to Huntress. We can equip better gear. Equipped, and I think that's my last unit. And I know it's her. Oh wait, I'm not. I'm not using that unit. 
Hmm. Hmm. Well, she's fire. She's my only fire. Currently, I want to give her some love. There we go. I also want to give, you know, we're, we're, we're going to give all of them some love. I don't care if I go broke. It's fine. It is fine. Let's go to challenges. And continue moving forward. Hoping something amazing happens. I'm definitely going to be trying out this game more. Uh, I, have an, I have an interest in it. You know, the the, the combat is, you know, it, it, it's your basic idle game combat. Um, but, you know, depending on how the PvP is, I'm like very interested to try out different compositions of characters and see how they fare against other uh, players' uh, units themselves. That's something that I find joy out of, you know, just having like a bunch of options and, uh, you know, just throwing it out there and seeing what it does. It's also like one thing I enjoy about uh, idle games or I, I guess any game in general that just allows you to um, play however you want. So like, you know, not each fight is the same. Everyone's using different things, so as you can see, ice is being ice, and literally um, encasing my units in blocks of ice and stopping them from attacking and whatnot. But we do not falter. But I'm sure if uh, um, they were a little bit higher level, would have been troublesome. Because I've always found in most video games, ice is freaking strong. Like in any video game, if you can stop your opponent from literally playing, from moving, from like doing anything, you're winning. You're on the winning side. You're on the right side of history. So keep that in mind. Ice is a, a force to be reckoned with. Um, ice and like dark, it's, it's usually insane units. Darkness oh, has like a bunch of debuffs and uh, confusion attacks. I'm sure, you know, all the affinities are, uh, are very viable. Here's the map. We can also go a bit higher, it seems. Perhaps when we, uh level up more ooh oh and there's down here so wow if we could zoom out oh my goodness look at that if we could zoom out of the map i think that'd be neat this would look super 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 gorgeous hmm let me collect that and and where are, where are we actually? We are 311. Hmm. So I guess before the video gets too long, I kind of want to start wrapping it up. You know that 30 minute mark's coming up. In the next video, I'm I'm gonna play a little bit more off recording, and then we're gonna get these 3,000 gems and uh. At the start of the next video, at the start, I swear we're pulling 10. We're pulling 10. I, I, I promise you that I'm hoping I don't have to like play too long so that I, it skips over everything. But you know what? We can at least treat ourselves to a 10x uh, summon before I end this vid. And we got something new. Descartes. A scholar has a love for knowledge. I love knowledge. I love learning. I'm constantly learning every week, every month. Teresa. Wow. Wow. She's a nun. So we got three new units. 
Um, Minamoto no Yoshi Tsune. A naive and romantic witch. With a with a bow. Hmm. She is naive indeed. <laughs> Witches don't use bows, do they? <laughs> None I recall. Okay. Oh, well, that's uh. So she's fire, agility, dealing physical damage. I might have to use her. Oh my. Let's see what everyone is saying. Like for free gems. <clears throat> I don't I don't I don't know how true that is. I I I uh, I mean if I can get free gems from people liking my comments. So she is fire. I might be replacing UG. Yeah, I think I think we're replacing her. Let's let's replace her. Um I'm, I'm I'm sorry, madame, but your time in the first lineup is up. Unforge. 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 And we're gonna give her amazing gear. I don't think we can. I can take this off of whoever's using it. Anderson. Am I using this person? I don't know. I'm gonna take this. Anderson. I hope I'm not taking something off of, uh, people that I'm actually using. Okay, so I'm not using Anderson. Alright, let's change my lineup. Removing her and putting her. Save lineup. And let's do one, one battle for the YouTube. So yeah, she's in the back right here. Wait. Oh no, I forgot to... So not only do I have to rem uh, r switch her in the lineup, I also have to switch her in this challenge scene. So... Yeah, that... that I, I, I don't get it either. So yeah, always remember to switch them right here. So we're gonna challenge, and then we're gonna remove, then we're gonna add, and that should be that. Now, let's see her. See what she does. Get that defense up. Her special of what? Yeah, so she, it, it was the right choice. He has AoE, he has a uh, line DPS, single target, she's pretty nutty. Did we lose a- <laughs> We lost a life, no. <laughs> so yeah, I'm gonna uh, level up some more and I'm gonna push for 3000 gems. Um... So that next time that I upload a video, we can like get directly into that as usual. Thank you for watching.